What's up, how's everybody doing? Welcome back to the channel. All right, guys, we're about to jump into another episode of Making Moves. Uh, if you guys are new to this series and uh, you guys feel like it's intriguing, definitely hit that subscribe button. Uh, a little insight on this deal is pretty much me, you know, dealing with team maintenance. You know, if I have to sell a player here, you know, buy a player, just keep the well-being of the team up. That's what this series is about. Uh, making moves, man, pretty much. You know what I mean? That's why I chose the name. Show you guys a quick little look at the squad. I know I've been getting a couple of new subscribers here and there the last couple of days. Uh, this is the team, guys. You know, nothing, nothing too spectacular, but they definitely get the job done. These are the guys that create all the havoc, all the confusion. Offenses hate them as they should, damn it. You know what I mean? We, we ain't here to be friends. We here to win, baby. All right, but on a serious note, I asked you guys a question on the last gameplay video uh, of the season. I think it was week five uh, that I just got finished posting. Uh, hopefully, you guys watched it. All the true fans already watched it, and now they're watching this video. So if you acting confused and discombobulated right now, guess what, guy? My finger's pointed at you. You're not a... No. Nah. Uh, everybody's a true fan, man. I'm just uh, poking fun at, at you guys, creating small talk. But I asked a question in the last video. You know, uh, asking you guys what card do you guys think I'm, I'm, I'm wanting to add to the squad. You know what I mean? Um, as you guys see, I mean, they, they pretty tough. I mean, like, I, I really don't, I don't feel like I have a lot of weak points on my team right now. You know what I mean? I, I tried to build them the best I could with the coins that I had at the time. And I think I did a decent job. I mean, a great foundation. I really feel like I have a great foundation, uh, moving forward. If I did want to, you know, switch people in and out, which I am, you know what I mean? I'm always thinking, I'm always uh, trying to, you know, improve and stuff like that. I mean, that's what this series is about. It's about making moves. And, uh, you know, that's that's what we're going to do. All right. So, saying all, all that right there, that's a perfect segue into uh, my wide receiver, too. As you guys see, it's showing that I have the 80 overall uh, Sterling Sharp there. Now, you guys know everybody pretty much got the uh, Mutt Season 92 overall, Sterling Sharp. Uh, let me show you guys the stats up on the card. Well, really, really the stats on, on the card right now is not going to be representative of what he was when he was, like, when he was the original version of himself that they uh, released the uh, 92 overall. Now, he has, like, an actual real card and not, like, whatever this Mutt Season deal. Uh, it's a 94 overall. I was actually thinking about picking that card up, you know what I mean, but uh, uh like I said, I, I, they, they just released a, another card, and some of you guys, me just saying that, what I just said, probably just figured out the card that I'm, that I'm trying to go after, especially um, looking at Brandon Marshall over there, <laughs> yeah, some of you guys, it, it just clicked, the light bulb just went off in your head, like, oh, yeah, man, you guys know I love my run block and I love my big receivers. And uh, I was actually about to get the uh, 94 version of Sterling Sharp. Now I don't even know if I if I can get this card. Uh, if you guys haven't figured it out yet, it's uh, Alshon Jeffrey. They just released the uh, final edition uh, version of him, and uh, he looks like a monster. I mean, he definitely fits the bill on on what I look for in a wide receiver: big, strong, fast, athletic. You know, he can jump, he can uh, he can catch, and most importantly, he can block. That's always going to be the most important thing. And Marshall is the best blocking wide receiver in the game. And, and that isn't going to change even when I add uh, Alshon on the team. Hopefully I can add him on the team in this video as you guys watch it. Now, it's gonna be, it's, I'm going to take a beating with my coins, you know, but I actually, you know, well, not actually what I'm talking about. I definitely want that car. Like, I can't think of another wide receiver that I would want to have, have on my team more than uh, Alshon Jeffrey because of, you know, all his intangibles, all of his physical gifts. I mean, the dude just looks like a beast. I checked him out before I actually started this video up. But, yeah, Brandon Marshall and having Alshon, dude, I can pr pretty much do whatever the hell I want, especially blocking. You know, there, there, there's not, I think, too many better blocking wide receivers than uh, that duel. All right, so let's head into the auction house and see exactly what the card is going. I should go straight to it because I was just looking at it. All right, here we go. Go to the buy now. Ah, 148. They just had one for 144,000. I had enough for it. As you guys see, I have 146,000 coins. So now I need to raise what two? Yeah, around 2,000 coins uh, to get this bad mama jama. Well, a little bit less than 2,000 coins uh, to get it. And then I'm gonna be like flat broke. I'm going to be 
flat broke after I do that. But I think I can sell some cars real quick and come back and get them. Hopefully he's not gone. I should have went and got the one when he was 144,000. At least I would have a, 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 you know, a few coins to still have in my pocket. I'm going to be goddamn uh, broke as a joke. I'm going to be so broke I can't buy a mosquito raincoat. I'm going to be just ass naked in the pockets. <laughs> you know, motherfucker rob me, he's going to be practicing. But, uh. We gonna we gonna go and get the car, man. I just, I, I just don't feel like it's a better car that fit my scheme better than uh Jeffrey right now. So uh, give me a second. I'm gonna try to sell some cars real quick or quick sell something, and I'll be right back. Uh, got some badges. I don't think I'm gonna do nothing with these badges. I need the coins more than dealing with these these funky badges right now. I'm not gonna quick sell the silver badge. I can I can get at least fifteen hundred on the auction block for that one. Uh, let's see how much we got with just these. Three, what? That's it? 325 coins? Damn, that ain't nothing. That ain't put a dent up in the equation. All right, let's go and sell them anyway. Jeffrey's calling my name. Dude, that's it? That's eight items for 236 coins. Discarding with leap. Man, which one? Who, who, who I need right now? I don't need none of these sorry-ass players. The struggle is real right now, guys. I'm trying to sell everything and anything, and I st I'm still by five hundred off, bro. A little bit, a little bit more, five fifty off, man. <sighs> From getting this damn card, and I don't see nothing else that I can sell. All right, let's see. Let's uh, let's quick sell that. All right, so damn, what what else can I sell? I feel, I feel like I done sold everything that I can sell, guys. I mean, I have these, these little, little head to head now. I mean, how much they going for? 250 a pop? Oh yeah, you can go. Oh yeah. We can sell two more of these. Okay, that's 500 right there. That's what we need, huh? That's what we need, ain't it? Alright, that, that should be enough. Let's go on and, let's go on and inquire to Jeffrey, man. Hopefully, man, he hasn't already sold, cause that'll suck after I done Quick sold my life away. Well, let's see, has he has he went down and nope, you still right there, guys. 148. Come on to the squad, young man. We need you. We need you. I got 211 coins, guys. <laughs> oh Lord, I got 211 coins. We got a lot of work to do. Man, we got a lot of work. That hurt. I mean, it didn't hurt because I I, I think he's gonna be. Uh, 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 a stud for the team, you know what I mean? I, I think he's, he's gonna be a monster. But, uh, God. Dude, man, I ain't, I ain't got nothing. <laughs> I ain't got nothing! I'm about to sell a lot of cards, man. I'm about to sell. I, I got a couple cards, uh, on the team that I, I could, uh, possibly get some coins for. Alright, anyway, let's, uh, let's go on and add him to the squad. I just wanna see what, what he looks like. Alright, so, uh, look like I need to change my damn name to the, uh, Chicago Bears wide receiver core. <laughs> I want, you know what, hold on. I'm, I'm tripping, guys. I'm padding, uh, and I'm tripping. You got to go to the uh, second wide receiver, uh, Marshall. Alshon done took your damn starting position. There we go. That, that looks a little better. That makes a little bit more sense. I mean, just, I'm, I'm just saying though, guys, don't that look nice? I mean, to me it looks nice, bruh. Dude, we got we got some beasts, man. We got two beasts on the outside. You know what I mean? The beast in the backfield. My offensive line needs work. Definitely. You know what I mean? I mean, I would love to have some of the best offensive linemen in the game. That ooh. Can y'all imagine me? As much as I run the ball with some of the best offensive linemen in the game. Dude, that that'd that that'd be damn near unfair. <laughs> You know what I mean? That'll, that'll be unfair, bro. But see, I, I like these guys that I got because they're all ground and pound. And uh, they definitely, you know, hold the blocks, I feel like, a little longer than a, a, a normal guy with just decent run blocking. You know what I mean? Uh, like, I don't really believe in chemistries that much. But I'm going to tell you, you know, wh what chemistries mean to me. You know what I'm saying? In Madden. The only time chemistries, like, I feel like matter in Madden is if one guy has it and the other guy doesn't. That's the only time chemistries matter. You know what I mean? Uh, like, say, like wide receiver, All right? Prime example, uh, the big boy that we just got, Alshon Jeffrey. If 
if Alshon goes against, uh, let's say, let's say, let's say one of the best, you know, uh, block shedding cornerbacks in the game, Rod Woodson. He's probably the only guy, especially him being ground and pound, and and one of my chemistries is ground and pound. He's probably going to be one of the few wide receivers of the game that can actually hold Rod Woodson for a second, maybe even a second and a half, to let my my running back get around him if I run to his side. You see what I'm saying? You know, because Rod Woodson doesn't have like a run stuff or a pass rush chemistry on on his card that I can remember. You guys, let me know down in the comment section if I'm wrong about this. But, uh, you know, if, if that card doesn't have, like, least run stuff or uh, pass rush, and both of those chemistries pretty much, you know, give you a uh, boost with your block shedding, you know. So if you don't have that, plus you're going against a card that's already good at run block. And let me show you guys some of the stats on the card. I never showed you guys that when I was talking about them. But as you guys see, the monster, you know, 79 frame. Anyway, we're talking about run blocking right now. Let's, uh, all right, let's go to, well, not run by chemistry. We're talking about chemistry, but we, we're, we're, uh, we're exampling his, uh, run blocking. He has 70 run blocking for a wide receiver. For a damn wide receiver! That is amazing. Some, some, some damn, um, tight ends don't even have that. So he, he's gonna be amazing on the outside, guys. Absolutely amazing. And, you know, Let's, let's say like, you know, mixed with that ground and pound that he has, that's going, that's going to boost any time I feel like he's going against like a cornerback that doesn't have at least a pass rush or a run stuff chemistry activated. You know, they can have it, but if it's not activated, the, if the opponent that I'm playing hasn't made that one of his chemistries, but you know, it doesn't matter. So I just feel like I'm, I'm going to be winning a lot, a lot of battles on that outside with Alshon Jeffrey. That's why I spent the coins on him, guys. You know, that's why I made the move. Make it moves, baby. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, man, I'm def definitely happy about that. Um, but, yeah, I think that's probably going to be the end of this uh, episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what y'all thought about the move down in the comment section below. Um, let me know if you guys were thinking that I was going to get Alshon Jeffrey. Uh, let me know if you, if any of you guys have played with old Jeffrey and how did he perform for, for y'all. You know what I mean? Uh, I like I said, I still feel like he's gonna uh, work perfect in my scheme. He's probably not gonna be good in a lot of people's schemes, especially if you don't use them right. Uh, that goes for any card. If you guys are excited about this card, seeing me, you know, use them on the uh, upcoming gameplay videos, uh, definitely hit that like button on this video. And uh, yeah, that's about it. You already know what it is. Uh, anybody new to the channel, definitely hit that subscribe button. Also, guys, check me out on Twitch. I'm starting to live stream a lot more. That's linked down in the description. Uh, check me out on Twitter. You know, if you guys want to retweet some of my videos, that would be greatly uh, appreciated. You know, definitely follow me there. And uh, also check me out on my walkthrough channel. That's linked down in the description. Head over to my walkthrough channel. Check some videos out. If you guys like what you see, subscribe to that channel as well. Other than that, I appreciate all you wonderful people. Y'all already know what it is, man. It's your boy Cooper. Go live. Shadow